Hello everybody, today I'm going to be teaching you how to save a corrupted file in GameMaker Studio 2. Now this can happen for a variety of different reasons, uh, and there is a way to save your files for the most part. Uh, if your computer was completely destroyed, unfortunately then there will not be, but in some situations you can save the, the files and your progress if you don't have a backup. So this is our corrupted file here. Uh, we know it's corrupted because when we try to open it, nothing actually happens. Game Maker loads, and it doesn't matter how many times you restart Game Maker or restart your computer, still just nothing happens. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to go up to uh, our buttons up here and where it says Open Project. And we're going to find the, the file that it was that was corrupted. So for us, it's this file here. This is our corrupted file. So we're going to close that out for now. So just, if you don't know where it is, make sure you know where this file location is. Okay, so I can I can go and see where mine is. Um, if you want, you can just leave this open. But we're going to make, what we're going to do is we're going to make a new project uh, and make it in, you know, whichever one you want. Name it whatever you want. Uh, I'll just name this YouTube video okay and so once this loads you're gonna want to go to here and again just know where it is and you might want to open it up now this is the part that's going to be somewhat difficult is you're gonna right click uh, add existing and then go to the file and so for example we're doing objects we're adding an object we're gonna to go to the objects and we're gonna double click on this and then we're going to add this. It's, it will be a .yy file, or at least it should be. Uh, and so then we'll open it and we'll add it. And it might not, it will add, you know, certain sprites that are associated with the object. You're going to have to go through and add that to every single object. And you're also going to have to do it for all the sprites. If you're missing sprites, you have to go through and add it manually to every sprite. Uh, all the tile sets, sounds, scripts fonts everything you have to basically hand import your entire game but it will save it for example say we open this uh, it still has all the code so I didn't actually lose anything because um, all the code is still there so I don't have to worry about that which is very fortunate it, it can be a pain and it is a pain but it will certainly be a lesson in backing up your stuff uh, in a future video we are going to discuss how you back things up, uh, what the different options are, and using version control. But for now, if your file gets corrupted on GameMaker Studio 2, this is how you save it. Uh, thank you for watching. I have a Twitter. You can go and follow that. Link's in the description. And I will see you guys next time.